Hi there. Um, here's a quick tip on working with titles in Premiere Pro. So what would happen is, let's say if you were to create a new title here inside Premiere, so let's call that title one, and let's 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 say I come down here and uh, I just call that title one, and then if I were to click drag it to the to my timeline here sequence. Uh, you've got title one right there. Now, a lot of editors are accustomed to just saying control C and then coming down somewhere down here, maybe on the, uh, the next clip and saying control V. Oh, I'm sorry, just targeting the wrong layer. So I'll say control V and there you go. And then what they would do is they would just come in here and change that to title two. But the problem here is that if you were to make a change here, you'll notice that it changes the earlier one as well. So it's actually an instance of the uh, the earlier title. Now, one of the like I said, this this has been addressed in in the recent update to Premiere Pro CC. So now, if you want to, for example, create duplicate titles here on the timeline, you could hold down Alt on the keyboard and just click and drag your title across. And what this does is, if you notice here in my project bin, is that it creates a separate file uh, uh, and not an instance anymore. So now if I were to, for example, come down to this title and change that to, uh, let's say, 3, you'll notice that uh, this one's title 3 as, as per the change, and the earlier one remains title 2 instead of being an instance like before. So just remember, it's basically you want to press Alt and then click and drag on your title to make cop uh, copies of them rather than instances of them. So I hope this is helpful. Thanks for watching.